gave me a lot of engagement in reading what went into the uh, the Agama traditions in our country. So I was also trying to read how we connect with the great teachers like Adi Shankara, Ramanaja, and Madhvacharya, etc. to the Agama traditions and the temple moment in our country. So today, in different parts of the country, temples, temple managements, and the heritage of temples, etc. are in the great challenge. Challenge for a number of reasons. And I'm sure that uh, this kind of meetings of minds, these challenges will be directly, you know, engaged. And I'm sure this in uh, normative spirit of the great Indian uh, culture will be able to meet them and then challenge them and, and probably subdue them. So let me read these few words and then conclude my speech. They say you dance, they say you dance to rhymes and rhymes of mystical trance. They say you dance to endless beats and scripts whose glance are live to eyes in greet. Dance, they say, your dance, they say, with words in dancing gay, is the dance of the universe, with need none for a rehearse. Your dance is the cause of my restless toss, of mind and thoughts to leap beyond the gross. Endless motions of the mind, endless motions of many kind, endless motions of indulgence, endless motions of pursuits dense. In silence, can I hold your dance? In silence, will you share your dance? In silence, can my prayers dance? To rest in silence with your true dance. When you dance, with a show of unfurled hair, will you to prayers pass and drop petals of your grace I can hold in all my mental wear. Thank you. Good day to all of you.